Tonight, Sacramento Mayor Daryl Steinberg is looking to increase his hiring and firing powers at City Hall. That's right. The mayor is getting ready to mount a strong mayor campaign that would go before voters on the November ballot. Let's find out more. CBS 13 Steve Large is live downtown with the mayor's race against time, Steve. Yeah, well, it's deja vu all over again here in Sacramento. You know, we saw Mayor Kevin Johnson seek strong mayor powers four times and fail each time. Now, Daryl Steinberg is in talks for another campaign, but he'll have to act fast. It's a new push for power inside Sacramento City Hall. <laughs> CBS 13 has learned Sacramento Mayor Daryl Steinberg is talking with labor groups this week about placing a strong mayor measure on the November ballot. He has only weeks before the August deadline and will need council's approval to do it. The mayor is getting a lot of pressure from people, uh, you know, about uh, the pandemic, about uh, racial injustice issues, about the police department. Sacramento political expert Roger Salazar says the mayor's last minute push is all about timing. The public is just listening. They're fed up uh, and they want some change. Let's see if this is the, the change they want. Why should an unelected city manager pick a police or fire chief? Steinberg supported Kevin Johnson's 2014 strong mayor campaign. Voters rejected it. In 2010, a separate Johnson campaign created lasting memories when the then council voted against strong mayor and Johnson took off his jacket and criticized his colleagues. I'm really shocked um, with, with really the way this turned out. We've seen more and more with elections, especially in Sac City, that if you go back and you ask voters and they tell you no, and then you go back again and you ask them and they tell you no, but you really have to do a hard look at, are the voters just saying no to this idea or do I really have something substantive I can change to get them there? Region Business CEO Josh Wood has run several citywide political campaigns, including the arena vote and Johnson's failed strong mayor campaign. He is skeptical a strong mayor campaign can be successful now. And especially given in this time, a council that will, as of November, be a majority minority council. Yet another strong mayor campaign in Sacramento. Be prepared. The mayor's office declined to comment for this report tonight, so we don't know the details of any plan he's pitching to labor groups. Meantime, he only has two city council meetings left before the deadline to get this on the November ballot. Yeah, the timing is interesting, Steve. We know you'll follow it. Thanks.